what's up guys this is sunny and today i'm back with another video as you can see i have my wife pc here i built a couple months back i'm sorry i didn't have any video of uh, building this pc or the time lapse. the reason why i kind of built that pc in like rush because she, she needed for her work purpose and her school so today what i'm doing i picked up a i3 4330 processor and i kind of got a really good deal from ebay i only paid 90 bucks for it so basically the reason i'm going from amd a6 7400k to a intel i3 4330 basically what i'm trying to do build her a windows 10 and dual boot basically windows 10 and hack and touch uh, el capitan so basically i'm not gonna use any graphic card or anything i'm just gonna use the uh, intel hd 4600 the graphics with the cpu you know integrated uh graphic so as you can see the motherboard i have here gigabyte h81m-h great motherboard for hack and touch if you're planning to build a hack and touch you can go with this motherboard and definitely a you know great motherboard for hack and touch now if you guys get the h81m dash hd2 kind of better because this motherboard doesn't come with the dvi only comes with vga and hdmi now the problem with bga and hdmi hdmi when you do hack and touch you can get sound out of it so if you get a motherboard the one comes same motherboard just hd2 in the uh, end will come with the dvi and can definitely use their motherboard for hack and touch and the sound and everything should work so today's video is a quick time lap and i'll just show you guys how i'm you know switching the parts and stuff and installing i hardly make pc building uh videos and stuff but from now on i will start making the video and if you guys have any question make sure you leave the comment below as you can see this motherboard does come with some option it's only 39 dollar motherboard i picked it up it was a christmas sale or from micro center so was fifth was sixty dollar but for now thirty nine ninety nine and it does come with uh, PCI Express 3.0 16x and only thing doesn't come with USB 3.0 but other than that it's a great motherboard comes with four SATA six and definitely worth buying so guys let me know what do you guys think and if like i say if you guys have any question leave the comment below and uh, basically the pc i'm building here right now will only cost me end of the day 350 dollar and uh it's definitely worth worth it for someone who is looking to build a budget hack and tosh and definitely will cost you way less than a mac mini for 499 dollar you will definitely you know get better performance out of it than a mac mini all right guys just enjoy the time lap and like i said don't forget to like subscribe share peace enjoy